welcome to my get unready with me I want to show you what products I use to take off my makeup and what moisturizers I use toning all that sort of jazz so if you'd like to see that then stick around first of all I would ordinarily take my makeup off using soap and water I wouldn't ordinarily use face wipes but for the sake of this video I will do that but I'll also show you what else I use uh, what products I use on my skin so the wipes that I use when I do take my makeup off with wipes are these Voo cleansing wipes spray the wipe with this from TK Maxx it is a face mist and it's got vitamin C and turmeric and I don't know what turmeric how turmeric would help the skin but it's in this face product and I quite like it so we're gonna use it <laughs> what the heck and it's alcohol free zero percent parabens no parabens don't even have a clue what they are and no nasty chemicals and no animal testing and that's important right so take a wipe and fold it in half take my vitamin c spray and spray it so it, there's quite a generous amount on the wipe So I'm going to go in and just start wiping. Now you'll see my skin react because it's very sensitive. It looks like I've been smacked in the face already. Awesome. <coughs> it's quite strong that. Very strong. That's a very, very strong um, orange scent. <sighs> That's my skin. Like it all a bit, Joe. So I'm gonna spray some of that directly onto my skin. There's also something else I used. <laughs> Look at the state of that. Wow. This is me being brutally honest with everybody at how bad my skin is. Okay. So calm it down a little bit I'm gonna use this aloe vera spray it's soothing sp facial spray aloe vera and I actually got this in Miniso which is a Japanese shop over here and um, I absolutely love it for calming the face down so oh, it's so refreshing as well smells beautiful so what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna use just a cosmetic pad to actually rub that in not too hard but enough just to get the makeup off that is a spot I have a um, like a ball thing there, but I also am developing a slight spot there as well, unfortunately. Just to go with my smacked ass skin. I'm just gonna spray some more. Mm, love it. So I'm gonna use the other side just to get a bit more of the makeup off. Let's do some toner. 
So this is L'Oreal Age Perfect Anti-Fatigue Toning Lotion. I'll just put some on a pad. nice and cool I actually like to just pat it on it's very cool it smells so good as well like so fresh just to calm my skin down a little bit mm. I wish you could smell it it's just amazing Get the neck. Still some makeup coming out. My little dog behind. How beautiful is he? He's a cutie. Aren't you a cutie? <laughs> So next, I decided to do something that I never do. I bought a face mask. So this is a two in one. Step one is a peeling gel. Don't know what it means by that. I think it's a gel that you peel off, uh, obviously. And step two is a wash off mask. Now I'm going in the bath after this, so I'm going to be able to wash it off. So I'm going to try it for the first time and hope my skin doesn't go crazy because it's so sensitive, my skin. Got to be so careful. But let's try it. So let's put the step one peeling mask on. For my 40th birthday, I'm getting lip fillers. I can't wait. I actually can't wait. Because look how small my bloody lips are. You can't even see my top lip. You can't see it. And I swear I've got a bigger lip in person than I do on camera. If I look in the mirror, it looks about twice the size. When I look in on camera, my lip has shrunk ridiculously. And my bottom lip is way bigger in person, I, I swear. But I really want lip fillers. And I want them quite a bit bigger than they actually are. So. I've been doing a lot of research on YouTube about lip fillers and what to get and what can be dissolved if it goes wrong, what looks plumper for longer and um, I, yeah, Juvederm I think it's called, I, I, I really want to get because apparently it can be dissolved if it goes wrong and it lasts longer. If anyone knows differently please let me know because I don't want it to go wrong but I, I really want my lips doing. That's what I'm getting done for my 40th. I'm also gonna get some Botox. And I'm also going to get uh, my eyebrows microbladed again, just as a top up because it's been a little while. Anywho, let's take this step one off my face. I'm gonna use one of these and my aloe vera take it off gently
off in clumps, like clumpy, clumpiness. Yuck, yuck, yuck. My dog's like, what the hell are you doing? Okay, let's take it all off. <laughs> is this bit here so this is a wash off mask that was supposed to be a peeling gel it says peeling gel so I thought you would peel it off but it said to wash it off and this is the wash off mask <sighs> just doesn't make any sense so let's get this minutes wash off with water are you kidding me wow I'll see you in 20 minutes so I have just had a bath and washed off the um, face mask my skin feels quite actually quite tight to be honest, um, it feels like it's done something, you know, when you do, you put like beauty products on and then you think, well, I don't really feel the benefit, but this is actually, it's feeling quite tight on my, on my skin. My skin's feeling quite tight, which is, I suppose, a good thing. Um, so what I'm going to do now is... Put my, oh, it's actually day cream, but it's green tea, green tea from Garnier Skin Active. And I like, I quite like green tea because it's quite. Um, I have got a towel on, by the way. <laughs> wash it with uh, my oh god do you know what i'm gonna take a glass of wine a glass of wine i'm gonna take a sip of wine because <laughs> i can't bloody speak tonight that's better so ordinarily i would use my face wash the one that i showed you in last but one video and then i would just go in and put my moisturizer on so Today it's had the cleansing pads with the facial spray, it's had toner, it's had moisturizer, it's also had a face mask, uh, step one, step two, and then I'm going in and moisturizing again. And that's me unready. This is me in the flesh without any um, without any makeup, being very honest about what I look like. Yeah, so I think I'm gonna try some new makeup looks in the next few weeks. Some different makeup looks that I'm not used to. Obviously I'm, I'm used to doing the same look, the same quite average, everyday, simple makeup routine. But I think I'm gonna try 
and do some different um, makeup styles. I'm going to take some tips from other YouTubers and I'm going to come back and show you my findings, good or bad. <laughs> so, um, yeah, and my 40th birthday is in September. I know it's quite a while away, but I'm going to hopefully take you guys with me when I get my lips filled. Can't wait. I'm gonna get my eyebrows done as well. So I'll get my lips filled, my eyebrows done. I'm gonna get some Botox where it's needed. And um, I think I would like eyelash extensions as well, but I haven't decided that I'm definitely gonna do that. So um, I will check in with you about that. Okay that's it i hope you enjoyed this get on ready with me and i will check in with you on the next vlog thank you for watching please subscribe to my channel and click a like and let me know any suggestions that you'd like to see thank you